at the finish here of qualifying race six in Red Fleet in the 49ers, the men's ultra high performance double handed trapeze skiff. It is a, a, a great sailor, Jack Hawkins, here in the lead. You know, so we, don't, we, don't, we sort of don't see him all the way at the front going, you know, out 50 meters ahead of anybody else very often. Uh, hopefully we're not on this line here too much, but watch them come. Per great stuff. Let's watch the jibe. Across they go. Kite comes across. Helm is out and the crew is out. Pretty solid jibe. Not the fastest out, but pretty well done. A little conservative. And uh, they've just extended here, to uh, Thomas and Hawkins. You know, it's something to be said about training in a gray, bleak, windy place like, uh, like uh, Weymouth. And uh, the Brits always seem to perform, and the breeze is on. Someone who's been performing all week long, though, so far has been Dominic Przybiatek and uh, Kolodinski here, Poland four. The Polish, uh, the top Polish teams, two of them in two different fleets, are really putting their stamp on this field. As you would expect, they're a great team. Uh, they train hard together, and they obviously know this water well. But here comes the battle here. The Langa brothers were in fourth, I think, going into, the, into today. And they really had a nice recovery despite nearly pitching the boat over, having a terrible jibe. And let's watch them as they roll in here to get on the podium. Really nice work there from the Langa boys. Take third, and here is the Aus 101. That is uh, Lockie Gilmore, the second half of the Gilmore clan that's here racing. And uh, Brazil 55 just behind. So that's Dante Bianchi and Thomas Lobier with a nice one here. The Alonzo brothers. With a nice head of steam, you can see the breeze is picked back up to about 12, 13. You know who we lost is uh, Diego Botin, and they're just now coming into frame. Let's stay with them here in the green kite. They are one of the quickest boats downwind. Look at them blowing through 140 and absolutely flying. Real athletes on the on the tra on the trap there. Diago Mora and Diego Botin and the British 140 coming in just behind. So. That's all for us today. These guys might do another race. We're going to go try and get some videos online. Thank you for watching. And a couple quick things. Go ahead and turn the camera around to me, uh, uh, Sotos. Couple, couple quick things. Uh, our question for the day, and we, we encourage you to head over to 49er.org or NACRA17.org, is um, like so many of these 49er sailors who've just competed in the Volvo Ocean Race, if you were asked to sail a race around the world, would you say yes? So go over and uh, go check in on the poll on 49er.org and on NACRA17.org. Also, finally, uh, for today, if you would like 18% off any Magic Marine gear, anything in the store, and this stuff is really nice. I'm very toasty with my beautiful, strangely seafoam green shirt or uh, jacket. But uh, anything in the store, 18% off. You can get you can get custom printing and stuff and all that. You can go on to the 49er.org website, click on the Magic Marine Store link on the top right, and uh, use the uh, promo code EUROS2018 at checkout to get your 18% coupon. And thank you for joining us today for our Magic Marine report from the water here in Gdynia, Poland.